How's everyone doing? Uh, so welcome to the Eliminator League. This came together pretty quick, so that's pretty awesome. Um, this uh, idea that I've had, um, heard it on a podcast, decided to try to bring it together. Didn't know if it's going to come together this quickly, uh, so thank you for joining. Uh, still some people left to pay. Um, we'll get all that together. Um, as you should know by now, uh, the way this is going to work is there's 20 teams. We're going to do a traditional snake draft, so 1 to 20, 20 to 1, 1 to 20, 20 to 1, back and forth. Uh, the league is set up where your team's going to look like such. You're going to have two quarterbacks, two running backs, three wide receivers, two tight ends, three flex, one defense, one kicker, six bench slots. Does this mean that our teams are going to suck early on? Yes, they're going to be very, very thin. Uh, but as each week goes by, one team will be eliminated. That entire team will go to the waivers. Then we will have $1,000 of fab which is the waiver budget so we'll have a blind auction that starts Tuesday once that team's eliminated that entire team goes to the waivers on Tuesday you start placing blind bids for those players Wednesday at I believe it's 10 o'clock Eastern I'll check the settings 10 o'clock Eastern Wednesday I believe We'll see who wins those bids, those auctions. You'll get those new players, and then we set our lineups for the Thursday kickoff. Each week, the lowest team score gets knocked out. It does not matter about your head-to-head -head matchups. It does not matter. We do not have playoffs in this league. Each week, a new team will get knocked out. Those players go. You use your fab to continue to bid on players to build the best team. You just try not to be last place. So, that is the goal of this league. Week 17, we're going to have four teams remaining. Those four teams will compete for the top three scores. First place will get the biggest portion, I believe is, uh, once again, I'll bring up the homepage here. So, first place gets $250, second place $175, third place $75. Uh, those are the payouts for this year. We'll play around with that, see how it goes. Figure this is kind of a war of attrition, so I wanted to make sure everyone got a nice little chunk out of it, of those three that make it to the end. Uh, fourth place, going to feel really bad for you because um, you're going to put in a lot, a lot of work to end up with nothing, but uh, that's, that's the penalty for not being at the best, not getting that bronze medal. All right, so uh, this is going to decide our draft order. I'm going to enter that in as I do this. Uh, what I'm going to do We're going to do a snake draft. have to update some settings here so, all right going to edit league home view draft order edit draft order all right so now I will start editing the draft order is right here uh, the name that the wheel selects first will be the 20th selection 
I will keep going until we find out who gets the first selection, which will be the last name remaining on the wheel. As each name goes, I will have it to where it eliminates the name, uh, and so on and so forth. So, here we go. Who gets pick number 20? Looks like it's going to be Robert. Robert Hicks. You get pick number 20. And a league this big honestly might not be bad. Removed. Let's go for 19. Looks like it's going to be Jeremy. Alright. Jeremy, you have pick number 19. There we go. Pick number 18. Looks like it's going to be GJ. GJ, you have pick number 18. Keep going. Byron or Casey? Casey. Casey, you have pick number 17. Here we go for pick number 16. Patrick. Patrick. Pick number 16. Now this is kind of the dead zone where I don't want to be. I want to kind of be at the front or the back. Now it's Byron. Okay, pick number 15. Pick number 14. Oh, it looks like it's going to be me or Joe. Joe. Okay, pick number 13. Looks like it's going to be Russell. Alright. Pick number 12. Amar? Amar has pick number 12. Could be a nice area, be right in the middle, not too far away from your picks. Looks like it's going to be Squirrel. Pick number 11. Alright, now top 10. Uh, Gerald. Gerald is number 10. Alright, number 9. Kevin. Kevin, number 9. Number 8. Like it's going to be Ball Preet. All right, number seven. Looks like it's going to be Matthew. Hey, number six. Looks like it's going to be me. Stay on Albert. Stay on Albert. Nope. I got the six pick. Top five. Uh, looks like Cody. Four. 
fourth pick. Looks like it's going to be Tim. Might get the Bradley. Tim. Top three. Going to be getting used the best kickers. That's what you want to go for with these top three picks. Bradley, number three. All right. Either Albert or Hype will get the second overall pick, which means the other one will be the top pick in the draft. And it looks like it will be Albert with pick number one, Hype with pick number two. Congratulations to Albert for the number one overall pick. I will upload this video. Hopefully uh, there's a way for me to upload it to the league. If not, I will make it available on Facebook and allow people to share it. Or I'll upload it to YouTube and share the link that way. All right. Uh, as always, if you have any questions, feel free to ask. I'll be happy to answer. I think I've explained it pretty well on the homepage, uh, the rules. Standard PPR uh, should be a really fun experiment. Looking forward to it.